Hey guys, this is Freelancer Munna. How are you? I hope you are well. So today we will know how can we integrate a address file on our Squarespace website. To do this, we need to go file request pro. We need to search on Google file request pro. Okay then we can see here a website file request pro this is actually third party integration squarespace have not like this feature to uh, attach our file on website so when your visitor or customer want to s send you any file then they can't send you any file because Squarespace have not attached file option on contact from or any other place so we need to add a third party integration okay <coughs> so we need to go file request pro dot com and and we need to create an account here okay mm, okay so if we go to login then we can see here uh, we have not uh, account here so we need to go to register and then we will put here a name like as my name freelancer munna and then and we need to put here our mail uh, like this freelancermunna.5.gmail.com and I am putting a password on to mm, okay I am changing it and we need to confirm the password and I accept and we need to register it when we will register it then we can see here OneDrive and Google Drive when a customer uh, if you are website owner then when your customer will attach their file on your website then you can receive the um, file on your OneDrive or Google Drive so we need to connect it okay I am connecting my Google Drive then I can receive them um, here okay I'm using another account password and now we can see here that it will be integrated okay here uh, need to give permission then we can access it I am just putting it here allow and then allow and after this process mm, we need to create here a new mm, page name page name just like I am putting freelancer Munna and paste URL yes and also send notification you can put here your another email then you can receive the same file with your Two email or three email and here you can put any page header I am just putting freelancer Munna and upload instruction you can put here anything logo image you can use I am um, just not need anything else if you need anything else you can uh, put here and your page security you can use here uh, security 
to upload this file so I am just saving it okay I'm saving it and after the save after the, the page name save you can see here copy embedded code you need to click here and then you can got a code and you need to copy it and on your square space I am logging my square space login and I can I am putting here any email account mm, just like this this account next okay internet connection is some slow so it's take some time okay and here I am taking a new template because this is my another client template mm, I am taking a new template to do this okay so just like I really choose a template that's called brain we start with brain and I am adding this code with my square space website then my visitor can attach to any file and then I can receive this file uh, on my Google Drive okay so this is my square space website and we will add the uh, this code we will add this code file request a pro website embedded code we will Put it on our SkySpace website. I am just uh, putting it on my home page. Mm, I have after welcome and about. If I am putting it on my about tab, just edit it, and and you need to take a. Code tag. You need to take here a code tag, and you need to copy this code, and you need to put it on your code and apply it. And if I save it, then I can see when I load my website. just like this this site is now private so I am making it a public site and setting site visibility password project I am just putting a password and then again re reload the square space given domain and I am putting here the password 
then we can see here that the code is integrated here like this uh, if you are a owner of a Scalistress website then your visitor can adjust here any file and uh, I am just checking it just click here and I am sending here a image I have this image and send file okay so we can see here a successful message thank you so much your file have been successfully uploaded and now if we check our Google Drive then we can see here the uh, uploaded file okay so I am checking it Mm, so it was my this mail this mail and you can receive a mail at first and then you can see that uh, this file is come and this is the file okay part 2 uh, if I click this file then we can see the file okay so I have you are all understand that how can we adjust a button on our Squarespace website and how can we receive the file if you have any any question then comment below the video and I hope I will help you okay thank you so much and please subscribe my youtube channel for update things. Thank you so much.